seeing nice, beautiful conditions for this morning. There is more rain on the way later on in the forecast. Currently checking out those conditions, 41 degrees outside in San Luis Obispo. Thankfully, those winds have calmed. That's something we did not see over the weekend. We saw lots more of those very gusty, wish, gusty conditions as we headed through the weekend. But overall, wonderful conditions out there this morning. A little bit on the chilly side, especially in those interiors. Only about 28 degrees in Cuyama Valley this morning, 32 in San Inez, and 38 degrees in Santa Maria. But anybody in those western portions of Santa Barbara County, you might want that extra layer as you head out the door this morning because you are under a frost advisory for this entirety of the section of the Central Coast all the way through 9 a.m. this morning. Just have a little bit of that added risk of frost. Probably going to want that extra layer there as well as in those interior valleys as well all the way through at 9 a.m. But we will be warming up pretty quickly. Temperatures will be back up into the 60s later on today. 63 degrees in Paso Robles and Lompoc, 68 degrees in San Luis Obispo, 65 in Santa Maria, 67 degrees in Santa Barbara for today. So comfortable conditions out there, a little bit cooler along our north coast, pretty similar to what we're used to for this time of the year, but still slightly cooler than those normal conditions. 63 degrees in San Miguel, Atascadero and Morro Bay, 64 degrees in Avila Beach in the five cities region, comfortable conditions there as well. 66 in Napomo, 62 in Pismo Beach, 62 as you head into Shandon as well. And along our south coast, slightly warmer, 66 in Govita and Solvang, 65 degrees in Orchid for today. Now we do have another system on its way that's going to move through starting Tuesday in those evening hours with some light rain to begin with. We'll see that continuing throughout much of the overnight hours as those winds shift as well all the way through Wednesday morning. Then we've got a little bit of a break, but the storm system will not be over just yet. That'll continue to make its way into the region, especially by the evening hours Thursday as well. Continuing to see that moving in from the south Thursday into the later portion of those daytime hours. That's when we're going to start to clear out, clearing out for the weekend as well. So there is a little bit more of a system. It's nothing nearly as big as we've seen some from of our last systems as well, but up to about three quarters of an inch. I think up to an inch of rain is possible in some of those higher elevations, a little bit less in those interior valleys from the system, but that's going to clear out pretty quickly Thursday into Friday. We've got nice, beautiful, clear conditions out there. No major concerns at this point. Then Friday, Saturday and Sunday, clear conditions are expected here on the central coast. And it looks like we're starting to move out of that more active pattern to a little bit more of that sunshine here on the central coast. Neil, back to you. Love to hear that.